everybody welcome back to my channel fashion plus Vicky I'm really excited for today for the uh, shopping haul that we have it's actually from Sheen again this time it will be my third um, try on haul from Sheen third time that I ordered from them and this time I spent like a hundred and six dollars and some change but um, I received a lot of items for this haul um, I'm, so I'm very excited we're gonna get started all right so I already opened the bag to kind of help me move along a little faster. So, all right, the first item that I got. Okay, this is a long vest cover up type of um, top. You just wear a, like a long sleeve underneath for fall. And it can even be carried on into the winter time because it, it can be like used for Christmas because there's red and black and white so I really liked the style of this the type of uh, plaid it almost has a um, like a like a plaid but it's not a flannel material it's a I want to say like a polyester and it's stretchy so okay this I got in 4x but I do like it and I'll show it when, when I have it paired with the outfit all together the other pieces I ordered to go along with this um, but it has a, wa a waterfall neckline, the way it kind of drapes, but I'll show you guys once we pull everything together. Okay, another item I got is uh, some makeup. So this is a makeup palette. Um, they have all different kinds of stuff on Sheen. I mean, um, not just clothing, but they have makeup. They have houseware items. They have stuff for pets, stuff for your nails. They have jewelry, shoes, boots, um, just general um, things, even phone accessories and stuff like that. So when I was on there, I wanted to look at some of the makeup. And, oh, this is taped right now. <laughs> Maybe we'll be showing you this once I can cut it. A little bit later on with some scissors all right <laughs> the next item we have is a belt <laughs> I was excited to get a couple belts from them this time so this it is stretchy as you can see if you guys can see a little better like this it's stretchy which is a good thing it has this cute little belt buckle. You can see the design in it. I think it's really cute. It should go with a lot of outfits that I have. And maybe with some dresses and like a denim jacket over a dress. I think that would be a really cute idea. Okay. The next item that we got is I bought some white pantyhose tights. <laughs> I actually bought this to go with the sweater dress that I got from Sheen my, with my second haul. If you guys remember the sweater dress that I that I bought, it was a little bit short and I thought I would either get white leggings or white pantyhose or tights or something. So I'm gonna try these on with today's haul and see how they look. So yeah, I got, got those. <laughs> they have a wide variety on Sheen, so. Okay, I got this is the uh, snake print. Again, I don't have anything like this, a snake print. I'm just getting into some of the animal print like designs. But this is just your basic um, short sleeve. And it's like a silky material and it's not stretchy. So I don't know how much give it'll have once I wear it. I got this in the 3XL. The uh, pantyhose, I believe, are one size, so I hope that these fit. I, I thought that I ordered them in my size, but oh, and this vest thing is, I believe, a three. Uh, I don't know if I got a three or a four X in this. I got a four XL in this, so it's, I'll probably be swimming in this, but we shall see. And this is a three X, so. 
there was another top that I really, really wanted that was snake print and it sold out like pretty fast. <laughs> Even when I had it in my shopping cart, that's the thing about Shein. If you have something in your shopping cart and if the items sell out, it'll be basically deleted from your shopping cart and it'll say it's unavailable. So when you put stuff in your shopping cart, <laughs> you, you have to kind of shop fast and buy it fast because it'll be gone, which that really sucked because I liked that blouse better than this one. But this is the closest thing I found to it. The other one um, had a longer um, line on it to cover your belly more and it was like, um, it flared out, it was really pretty. But <laughs> that's what happens, I guess. Next item, I got this uh, top here, and these are, this is called a Swiss dot, the Swiss dot design. This is really popular now, I've noticed with Sheen. It's a really beautiful top. I'll show you guys some more of the detail in it. You can see the neckline has this pretty, uh, like, ruching. Um, what do you call this? I can't remember. <laughs> Almost like a, um, a, not a flutter or flowiness, but, and then their sleeves, their short sleeve, but they do stretch for your arms. That's a good thing. And the sleeves are more sheer, as you can see, but there's a tank top inside of the top. So it's not as sheer, and it's a silky kind of material. Uh, ruffle, maybe that's what that's called, ruffles. <laughs> okay, and this, next item. It's like a little jacket. And it's a deep burgundy maroon color, like a dark red. And there you go. This is the, the front. Once I try it on, you'll see how it, how it goes. But And it's got buttons where you can um, button the sleeves up to make the sleeves shorter. So yeah, and this, sorry, I forgot to tell you the size. Um, where's the size at? Anyways, I believe this is a 3X. I don't know where the tag is. And this top here is a 4XL. So, which I got it because of the bust. The sizing and the bust on the tops are all different. So when you're looking at Sheen, just keep that in mind. Okay, this is the shapewear that I ordered. I don't know how this is going to fit, but <laughs> um, it's a 2XL and from what I read on the reviews, I, I really searched all the reviews for this, but they're saying that this is supposed to be stretchy enough for people with my waist size, so this is a shapewear for like, you know, your lower half of your body. I thought I can wear this with that sweater dress as well because of the pouchiness of the belly. <laughs> okay, then we got another belt. This one is also stretchy. <clears throat> doot, doot. <laughs> and then it just goes around your waist and then it has the um, like a little, just as soon as I can get it in there, but yeah, it just kind of goes like that. And got the metal um, gold leaf design, and it's a beautiful brown bronze color. It's almost an orangey brown color here on the belt part. So I think that'll look really nice with some of the outfits. Okay. This is one of my first polka dot items. <laughs> and this was only like seven or eight dollars. 
um, for the skirt and this is also a 3XL and it's a pencil skirt and it is stretchy like a polyester material but as you can see yeah it's like a dark red burgundy-ish color and I thought it would pair nice with the jacket that I got with the button on the sleeves okay next item okay this is a top that I got to wear underneath like that um, white vest that I showed you with the plaid design this is a just a black simple I can't find the size <laughs> and they called this a, a lettuce neckline as you can see and it's just like a ribbed stretchy like a mock neck lettuce um, and even the sleeves are like that and the um, the waist it's pretty thin so it's good to wear with layering stuff I don't remember what size it is oh here it's a 4xl <laughs> so I'm hoping it'll be big enough and stretchy enough so we'll see <laughs> more items to show you and this is a black skirt that I got almost the rib design like the little um, top I just showed you <clears throat> but this one is a 3XL and it's just kind of like a pencil skirt as well it's a little bit shorter than the red one just pretty basic And that can go with probably with that uh, waterfall vest and the black top underneath or I can switch this up and wear it with the red jacket that I got and the black top underneath or something like that different things I can do okay I got a couple more things I got just a little necklace simple necklace <laughs> it's got the uh, tassels on it it's got a rose on it and some little jewels around the rose I'll show you that once I try on my outfits. And let's see. Oh, I forgot there's a tie that goes with that. The first top that I showed you guys. This is a tie that goes with it. <laughs> and one more thing, last but not least, <laughs> I got a fedora hat <laughs> to wear. With my burgundy outfits so it doesn't really fit too well I I don't know if I'm gonna be able to pull this pull this off but <laughs> um, the thing is when this came in it was mashed down inside of a sheet of plastic and I had to try to puff this up and fix it but I don't know <laughs> it was very cheap so it was only like four four dollars and I really liked the, the belt buckle design on the side of the hat. But it's kind of been out of shape, so I tried fixing it. I really don't know <laughs> what I'm going to do, but we'll see. And then, of course, I showed you guys the makeup, but I'm going to have to open that. I'll put some of the makeup on, and I'll do my try-on haul, and I'll show you guys all the different looks that I received. All right, so we'll see you in a bit. Okay, I'm back real quick with the makeup palette that I got. And here's what the box looks like. Now the makeup um, line that they have is called She Glam, and there's all kinds of different things <clears throat> that you can choose from. This is an eyeshadow palette, and um, <laughs> it's called uh, Viva La Leopard. <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna show you what the colors look like as well. Okay, I know it's not so bright in here right now, oops but look at the colors in there aren't those pretty I got them because they're like fallish colors and then you've got your like orange your golden yellow you got this with the stripes <laughs> this is almost a glittery kind of look to it um, then you've got some darker 
bronzes that are shiny and some that are not as shiny. These are glittery down here. This is a darker brown, a medium brown. So, and these have a little bit of olive and green like army colors. So, yeah, I thought that was pretty nice. And I believe this was $8.50, eight somewhere, around, somewhere around that price. Okay, let's show you guys. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back <clears throat> with one of the, the looks, the first look. Um, I did put some uh, eyeshadow on, as you can see. It's got more of a fall like vibe to it, fall look to it. I did some of the golden yellow, then I did the darker brown, and then I did like some orange, and then like a glittery uh, golden color over the orange. <laughs> kind of blended it in together a little bit. So I think that eyeshadow looks pretty nice. All right, and so for this look here, I did the long sleeve um, top underneath. I have this um, <laughs> vest jacket waterfall. It's pretty big on me, but I think it, it looks okay. Um, and it even has this belt that I, you know, tied on here. And where's the other loop? There it is. So you can kind of fix it however you want to fix it. I put it off to the side just to give it a different look. Um, I paired it with the black skirt underneath, but as you can see, this vest is really long. <laughs> um, I would recommend wearing this with some jeans or like a red pair of leggings or black pair of leggings to kind of, kind of pull off the colors together. Maybe red leggings would make it pop because obviously this is too long to wear with like a knee length, knee length skirt. If it was shorter, it would be, you know, a little better. Or you can probably maybe even um, tie this somehow. <laughs> Have you ever seen how people are doing that when they're tying their tops like this? I don't, I don't know. I don't think that looks right. <laughs> but it's supposed to be flowy, I, I assume, anyway. Okay, so <coughs> I'll undo this. You guys can see. How big this is? This is in a 4X. I got it because of the bust. The top underneath is a 4X and look how clingy and tight it is on me. So, and my skirt is a 3X. I could have went up a size, but, um, you know, it <laughs> it's stretchy and so is the top, but it's very, very clingy. I'm not wearing the right underwear, obviously, with something like this. Maybe wearing the body shaper with this would make it look a lot better. Um, but if you're going to be wearing a wrap like this, then I think you're good to go because it covers all those issues. But like I said, I think I'd recommend wearing this with pants or something. Or jeans. <clears throat> so, um, it's okay, I guess. It's not that bad. <laughs> I don't have any shoes on right now, so... We're just going um, bare feet. <laughs> so let me know what you guys think. Here's the back. The side. <laughs> it's very cute. You can wear it open up or you can wear it tied with the belt that they give you. Or if you have your own belt that'll match, you can, you know, change it up. If you want to do a red, a red belt would look really nice with this. Some red pants or leggings. So I'll have to keep that in mind. Maybe um, get a red pair of pants or something. And that would look cute for Christmas time, like a holiday outfit. <clears throat> All right, guys. We will catch you with the next look. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm back at you here with another look. This is the same black skirt that I just wore. Um, and then I paired it up with the um, reptile, oops, excuse me, lost my balance, the reptile <laughs> uh, snake print. So let's get close so you guys can kind of see how the design is on this. I think it's pretty neat. It's different. It's cool. I'm ready for fall because it's got the browns, the blacks, the different shades of brown in it and gray and stuff. 
And it even has a little um, keyhole on the back. And there's a little button back here, the detail. You guys can see that back here. So that's a cute little little add add on to the top. And it's just got a rolled sleeve design. Um, it's already sewed, so that's supposed to be how it is. It looks like it's rolled up. <laughs> so this will look really cute with a brown sweater or even a jean denim jacket or even a black, um, you know, jacket or sweater. I even paired it up with my Walmart boots I got from Walmart. So let's fix this so you guys can kind of see the boots <laughs> from Walmart. They still have the tags on them. <laughs> I haven't really worn them yet, so. <laughs> I think that looks pretty cute together, but I think I would pair it with some leggings or some pantyhose because my legs are so pale <laughs> and because we're in the colder season right now. So wearing some tights or pantyhose, I think would look better with this. Um, so I know even leg warmers are coming back into style now too. So maybe I like some leg warmers would look nice. <laughs> with the pantyhose. So let me know what you guys think about this look. I think the skirt looks better with a top like this, you know, better than the first um, long vest that I had on. So here's the back. All right, guys. Just let me know what you think if you like this look. All right, we'll catch you in the next look. Okay, guys, here's another look. <laughs> um, this one's really different from anything I ever usually wear, from the hat to the jacket to the skirt <laughs> with polka dots. <laughs> but, um, yeah, we're going to show you this look. Something in my eye. Hold on. Anyway, um, first off, we have the fedora hat with the little belt thing that goes around it. We got our little... Um, burgundy red jacket. We have our Swiss top that we have underneath, which I tucked into the skirt because it's pretty long, um, longer. It would have been hanging out here behind my jacket and I thought it looked a little bit weird like that, so I tucked it in. I have our little necklace here. It has little like rhinestones around the rose. And it's got the um, tassels on it. It would go with it would go with red or orange. So I think that's really cute. <laughs> and then the polka dot skirt. I wanted to show you guys. You can either wear this like a regular long sleeve, or you can uh, roll it up. And they have a little button on here that you can attach it to. So I thought that that was pretty cute. And I think they call this a waterfall neckline, which it kind of, you know, goes like this. And you can wear it like this, or you can wear it a little bit like outwards like that to give it a whole different look. I think it's really pretty. Um, it's different than anything I usually wear, but if you wanted to wrap it up and wear it with a belt, you can even do something like that. So yeah, we're going to take this off and show you the top. So this is that Swiss dot top that I have on and it's got that pretty ruffle neckline. And these sleeves, they do have a uh, stretch to them. It's got an elastic band across it and they are sheer. Let me show you the length of the skirt. It goes down below my knees, right down here. Now, if I were to take this out and show you guys how long it is. <laughs> Hold 
one. I'm stuck. There we go. <laughs> All right. Still stuck in there. Here we go. So you can see it's a little bit longer than that jacket. It was sticking out the back and it just didn't look right. But if you were going to wear it without the jacket, you can do something like this. Nice and flowy. It's a really pretty design. Here's the back. Here's the side. <laughs> yeah, so let me know what you guys think. <laughs> All right, here's my hat. <laughs> so, kind of looked like I was dressed up for Sunday church. <laughs> All right, guys, so I just thought it'd be cute to incorporate, you know, the Swiss dots with the polka dots. I thought it kind of looked good together. Just let me know what you guys think. All right, guys, here's a few more pieces that I switched around to wear, you know, with this together. Um, yeah, here's that jacket, and I paired it with the long sleeve black top and with one of the belts that I got. I really like the design and color variation in here. I paired it up with the little tassel necklace and the, um, the black skirt. You can either wear this with some red um, flats, that I think that would be really cute, or some like red boots, or even some red pantyhose. Um, I wasn't sure what to do like with this. <laughs> I kind of left this one down. Um, I don't know, this might look okay, you know, if you want to roll this up. <laughs> it might look okay, so. Just kind of play with it and see what you like. And you can, you know, have a little cute layered look. I think this looks nice together. And here's the back. So I just kind of uh, mismatched some of the pieces that I bought <laughs> to give it a different look. So let me know what you guys think about this look as well. My necklace keeps going backwards. <laughs> I'll have to fix it. All right. So, yeah. Um, I think that looks kind of cute together. <laughs> I think the, the belt like ties the look together a lot, too, and the necklace. But um, if you wanted to, you can just leave your, the sleeves down. Or even roll them up together. Maybe that would look nice. It just depends on what you like. <laughs> that kind of reminds me of the 80s with the rolling the sleeves up and everything. <laughs> and the jean jackets they did that with. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, I like this look. I hope you guys like, like all the looks that I've showed you. Um, we're going to see what else we can do. All right, hold on. Okay, and um, here, actually here is... The look with the white pantyhose that I got. <laughs> so that looks pretty nice too. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to try my polka dot skirt on and with the white pantyhose. Okay. <laughs> Obviously, I'd wear the white top with it, but <laughs> just so you guys can kind of see the white pantyhose. So. <laughs> There's all kinds of different things you can do with these pieces. It's kind of why I bought similar pieces for the colors to kind of match together so I can do different things with all the different pieces that I bought. Um, I try to do that like when I shop at the stores too, but you know, I kind of wanted to just try a few different looks, things that I normally don't wear and stuff like that, different patterns and materials. And I've never really had a pencil skirt before, <laughs> so. All right, I may sh show you guys one more look so we can just kind of see how it looks together. My sweater dress that I bought with my last sheen haul, and I'll, you know, put them on with these uh, tights. All right, guys, this is the final look that we're going to do for the day. <laughs> Um, yeah, so this is a sweater dress that I bought from my um, second uh, Sheen haul. Um, if you remember, 
I uh, modeled this and I thought it was pretty short and um, but I decided to buy these white pantyhose tights to try to see if I feel more secure um, I think they look pretty good together you know I think I'll be more secure I'll just be careful when I bend over I can even wear them with some leggings um, but I paired it with this belt that I got received this this time with the um, gold like little pretty leaves and it is stretchy but I also um, this sweater dress already you know came with a regular belt so you can do either one so I just thought since I didn't model this new belt I would just you know throw it on with this for for now <laughs> I did try on the body shaper that I bought it is way too small <laughs> Um, it doesn't fit on my waist, right? It's it's too tight, too small. I should have went with my intuition and bought one size up, but I'm stuck with that now. Luckily, I didn't pay a lot of money for it, so it's not a huge total waste. But <laughs> so this is the regular sweater knit belt that came with with the sweater dress. So you could do either one. <laughs> They're both pretty cute, you know either this one or this one so all right I hope you guys like all the looks that I showed you today I try to mix and match and like do a variety to kind of see what what I liked um oh these also roll up <laughs> it looks a little better when they're rolled up I think so <laughs> we've already been recording for 32 minutes so we're gonna um, end this video and I hope you all like what you saw all right so let me know what you guys here's the back <laughs> let me know what you guys think I'm sorry I was a little bit awkward today and talkative today <laughs> all right guys thank you we'll catch you in the next one um, I appreciate each and every one of you please um, comment share and subscribe if you haven't already, please share my um, channel. Let your, your family and friends know and your girlfriends know. All right, thank you guys. Peace out. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.